So when you make your way into the hotel, to the left hand side, there is a mirror. Hey! And then here, there's a small coffee station, cookies, chocolates, mixed nuts. And then here, there's a fridge. Come through this way. The first thing that you see is the very gorgeous bathroom. Have a look at this. So besides that, if you go down this way, this is the main bedroom. And we actually have two double beds. This is so crazy. Outside here, look at our view from this huge balcony. It is so hot. Oh wow. One of the pools. There's a beach as well right there. Wow. Look at all of this. Ah, oh, there's a train going across right there. And there's a hot air balloon as well. Oh wow, that's so cool. I think we're gonna go and get to go on that. I hope we get to. Good afternoon guys, good afternoon. Checking in from the Atlantis, the Palm Dubai. Guys, oh my God, we checked in so like an hour ago and I'm literally just taking the time to just chill. It is, I believe we are three or four hours, three hours ahead of London. So your girl's feeling good. We had a long flight. Our flight was actually delayed from London, which was really, really annoying. And then what was even worse, what was worse was the fact that there was two screaming kids on the plane. When I say screaming, I mean the definition of screaming. Like those kids were testing out their vocal cords for the whole flight. I felt so sorry for that particular cabin because when I walked past to go to the bathroom, when I say every single passenger, like I mean near enough every single passenger had like orange earbuds on because the kids were screaming, two of them, the hoochah. I say, God, when that time comes, Please just give me kids that don't scream on planes because I know the mom, the mom looked so stressed. I felt so bad for her because she was just like, what am I gonna do? And the dad was trying his best. Like, I actually feel it, I feel it, I feel it. I can, you, you can see they were trying, but it didn't help that the kids were screaming the whole entire plane down. Air students going up and down, like trying to just, somebody make them stop. So honestly, when we got to the hotel, it was like, oh, thank God, like peace and quiet. This is our first time. Oh, this is my first time in Dubai. Damini has been here before. He had like a stopover, like a seven hour stopover. And then he hopped out and came to do a little tour, sightseeing and whatever. But this is my official time. And we are here with the Atlantis Hotel. Thank you so much for the invite. I feel so blessed. Like honestly, I feel so, so, so blessed because the next few days, the next few days are gonna be so, exciting so much fun so we checked in i've just had a shower and now we're about to go for lunch lunch is at 1 p.m and it's actually 10 minutes past one and we're going to gordon ramsay's uh, kitchen so the plan for this week is for us to explore the atlantis the palm and then later on in the week we're gonna go and stay with our friends who just moved to dubai and that's so exciting so we literally get the best of both world i'm talking like hotel lux and then also chill family situation like I, I can't wait so the thing that i'm most excited about when we're here is obviously to explore everything go to the aquarium go to the water park go have breakfast i was with mimi last week and mimi was like Lydia, you have to have breakfast at saffron's and i was like oh okay noted with thanks so lots of fun to come throughout this vlog and if you haven't subscribed please make sure that you hit the subscribe button also like the video because it then pushes this video to other people who like this kind of content also really excited to be filming on my new camera which is the canon g7x mark 3 shout out to canon for sending this to your girl i am so excited to be capturing this holiday in hd 1080p i wonder if it goes up to 4k i actually don't know but you guys let me know let me know how, how am i looking how's the quality looking is it looking good? I hope so. Oh, also, we have a really big room. We have like two double beds in our room and oh, they laid them out so cute. It was like rose petals, like it was so cute little design. Welcome to the Atlantis. And Danny, oh bless him. He's so, so cute. Look what he's done. He's gone and put them for me in the bath. And I said I wanted to take a shower earlier, so he put them for me in there. But I'm actually not a bath kind of girl. So I took a shower, quick shower instead. But I'm still like admiring him. I'm like, oh, 
so romantic. I'm excited. This next like the next week is gonna be good fun. Just me, my husband, and like and a good time. Like what's new? Literally, what's new? Oh, shout out to All London by the way for my nails. Look at my nails. We had a little bit of gold reflexes in there. Black owned salon. Love. Let's go. Look what has just been delivered to the room. This looks so cute. A fruit platter. Am I meant to break this? Yeah. Yeah, Using this? With the hammer, yeah. Okay. You've got a chocolate hammer and a chocolate ball. <laughs> I think so. Okay, should I do it? Let's yep. do it. Very nice. Thank you so much. Thank you. Enjoy Thank your you. stay. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Have a good day. Thank you. So this is what has just been delivered. I've just moved a little bit forward so that you guys can actually see what's going on. It says break me. Ready? Wow, that's so much chocolate. Inside, there's more chocolate. Oh my god, there's even more chocolate. It's like a chocolate mousse inside. It's like a chocolate fudge. It's so sweet. Mm -hmm. This is the view from our hotel. This is our room right here. And this is the view. I'm trying to figure out what sea that is, because that's a sea. The Persian Gulf. The what? The Persian Gulf. The Persian Gulf. I didn't know that there was a gulf in the desert. And then this is man-made, right, surely? Yeah, basically. The one opposite. There's like all this really gorgeous glass blown art in all around the hotel. I say it's art, but really look, that's a light. That's a light, but well, that looks like an art piece to me. This whole place is so gorgeous. It's huge, guys, by the way. I haven't even explored anywhere near, not even any of it. But anyway, this is the lobby here. Let's walk to the lobby. Somebody smells good. Is it somebody or is it like, there's a little incense here. I think there was an incense. Or maybe it's somebody. Look at Damini, completely transfixed by this. It is very nice, Damini in his caftan. Look at all of this. Guys, as if there's a WH Smiths here. That's so funny, so funny. And then there's other stores here, his and hers. You can do some shopping. This is a hotel, by the way. This is not a shopping center. This is just the hotel. I feel like you could spend so much time in this hotel without actually having to leave. Look at this. The shelves. The shelves, what, these giant shelves, right? I thought they were, they look like elephant trunks to me. Yeah, that, I, th I thought that too. Guys, look, as we're going down to the restaurant, look at the aquarium. Stop it right now. That's so amazing. Wow. This place is huge. <gasps> There's water everywhere, literally everywhere. Whoa. Dalmatian stingray. There's a shark. Who's this guy? He's grumpy. Babe, look, giant dories. Yeah, What the hell is that? Is that a shark? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Wow. Dalmatian stingray. Guys, look at the shark. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Two sharks. Oh, look at that. I've just realized that I have lost an earring. Damini has gone to retrace my steps to try and find it for me as I watch <laughs> all this fish. Guys, this is crazy. Like, I'm looking at Dalmatian stingrays. I'm looking at giant sharks. I'm looking at so much fish. Like, I feel like a child. This glass, who made this glass? That's what I want to know. Who made this glass? Because this has to be some real strong stuff because... <laughs> There's a shark. There are several giant sharks in this tank. And Dalmatian stingrays, look at that. Crazy. That's a huge stingray coming over. Huge sting. <gasps> what on earth was that? Guys, my cocktail has arrived. It feels like we're back home. Look yeah. at that. There's a cocktail inside there. Doctor Who. Oh, wow. That's cool. That's so cool. Thank you. I love it. Do I like it? I love it. It looks like a potion. Do I shake it? Yeah, it's fine. Okay, I just pour it. Yeah. And it has glitter inside it. Wow. Wow. Thank you. It's very nice. Good 
afternoon guys good afternoon actually no you're doing good afternoon it's a good evening at this point child it is 7 14. your girl has just woken up from a nap because wow that food hit you know when the food hits went to bread street kitchen gordon ramsay's restaurant in the atlantis guys this place is huge okay like it's so big it's so 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 big i'm shocked as to how this is even a hotel it doesn't even feel like it it feels like you're in one giant shopping mall like with access to absolutely everything like so many restaurants so many different places to eat so many things to do so many things to see like walk past sharks actual sharks people scuba diving with the sharks giant stingray like it's huge i could probably i don't know how many steps i could get just walking up and down the hotel but a lot anyway we came back i literally fell asleep i was so tired you know literally we flew in this morning so i fell asleep unfortunately i missed cocktail hour oh my gosh so literally just got this note but we already knew about cocktail hour so this is a little invitation to the club lounge in the upper floor for a cocktail reception but girl i was asleep i was asleep damini went though and he said he had a really good time like he said he had a really nice some really sweet cocktail with was it guava he said i don't know I don't know. I don't really rock with guava too tough. I don't rock with guava. I don't rock with papaya. And I certainly don't rock with avocado. I don't rock with those three fruits whatsoever. Anyway, it is now 7.14 and I need to get up and get ready. We just got a call from downstairs saying that Lost and Found found my earring. Oh. Speaking of which, Damini is literally coming back. He went to get it for me. Lost and found, found my earring. Remember I was telling you guys earlier on that I lost it. Thanks, babe. And look, I just knew that they'd find it. I don't know why, I just had faith. Uh, look at them, I've got my earrings back. And guys, if you knew how big this place is, it doesn't actually make sense for me to get this back, but I just knew I'd get it back. I just knew I would. I feel like this is not the kind of place where people would like steal your stuff. Like guys, you, things are expensive. Things are hell expensive around. So it doesn't make no damn sense for somebody to steal this earring. Like, why would you to steal that anyway i am gonna go and start getting ready now for dinner we've got dinner at nobu which i'm very freaking excited about so we shall catch up when i'm ready i'm just It's my first time ever wearing or buying anything from them and I think it's really really cute. Definitely likes it too because it really looks nice on me. And then shoes, we're going for Steve Madden's. Really really shiny. I actually got these in silver and in gold for my wedding. Never wore them because who would wear, who in their right mind would wear these on their wedding day? Like they're so high so absolutely not. But these are the shoes of choice today. Just need to moisturize and then I'm done. Oh, and earrings. Oh, babe, see you did here. Question, 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 question. Earring, earring. Oh, And the thing about these ones, look, babe, they're different. They're like, they're odd. Oh, okay. Yeah, take this, these ones. They know better. I'm not mad at these. I'm not mad at these either. I feel like these are a bit kooky. They are. Not a bit. They're very kooky. I'm so glad we found them, guys, because, ooh, I don't know. I don't know. A bit of both. I just wanna... <laughs> So we have finished dinner and we've come outside and look at the view. I'm down for the cheapest ring on the neck, finger, little bitch. I don't feel 
Pulling out the spray and beer, my domain, all my bitch. Drop three dollars on the rain, call me in the truck, little bitch. Ooh. I was in the trap, serving cocaine, they ain't been the same thing. Guys, so we have just finished dinner at Nobu. That was M. Impeccable. That was literally the most delicious dinner I have had in a while. The black cod that came highly recommended and it's coming highly recommended from me too because that was delicious. The wagyu tacos, the black cod, the sushi. Listen, everything was absolutely fuego. Like absolutely el fuego. I loved it. Loved it, loved it. You've just seen a little bit of the hotel as I was walking through. This is some more of it. This is like the West Tower. We are in the West Tower. Oh, it's the left. Damon not with me because he's gone to get my phone that I've lost. Guys, I am a hazard. I'm literally a walking hazard all the time. I lose things all of the time. He loves me and he really doesn't mind. He really doesn't at all. So I am now so full. My belly is so round. This is not how this dress started off in the start of the evening, but it was great. Really great. And I'm looking forward to getting home, getting to my hotel room, literally. Imagine going to dinner and then being home in like one minute. I'm going to a proper dinner as well. Yeah, I'm just excited to literally get in, take my makeup off, and just chill with my man. Good afternoon guys, good afternoon. It is 3.30 p.m. That's when we're leaving our hotel, our room rather. We're definitely not leaving our hotel. This hotel, you can't leave. Where are you going? Because <laughs> all roads lead back to the palm. We've been home a great time. Guys, last night, babe, tell them about Nobu, please. I've been hearing people gas about Nobu since, you see, I'm from London, innit? So yeah. everyone's been talking about Nobu, no, especially the girls. But I actually get the hype, like, uh, Nobu was fire. Fuego. I think we made it for like seven, eight dishes. We tried. Week, we had the, the we had the sriracha. We had the edam edamame. edamame, spicy edamame. We had the spicy taco. The, the we wagyu. had the wagyu tacos. Yeah. Please, if yeah. you ever come to the Atlantis. Yeah. And you, you hit Nobu, 100% the, the Wagyu tacos? Wagyu tacos So they, they had these fried rice squares with soy sauce And crab And then this crab mix oh. And me, I'm very somehow about crab sometimes Yeah like 15 out of 10 20 out of 10 That was fantastic Yeah Oh, the chicken wings, okay, the chicken wings Yeah They were very, tiny very small. I don't know what kind of chicken that was Oh, the shiitake mushroom salad Woo. Oh, oh, the yeah. shiitake mushroom that salad was actually Really, really so now we are about to go to the pool to check out the pool like there's a big slide there's a whole water park area but you guys know like i'm literally so injury prone and i'm just recovering from my injury on my shoulder hence why i have these marks i keep telling you guys i'm recovering from my injury on my shoulder i'm recovering from my injury on my back i'm like i just feel like going on a water slide a water park is probably not the best idea so yeah we're just gonna go by the pool chill by the pool for a couple of hours and then we have drinks later on the drinks that i was wasn't able to make yesterday that Daphne went to. I want us to go to today. Swim as per usual is Kai Collective. Like, love it. Black owned swimwear. I wore this on our honeymoon. I wear this literally everywhere. It's like my favorite bikini pretty much ever. So this is it. Kai Collective, black owned. Andrea Ayama, black owned too. And then PLT here. I love my hair like this. I really do. It's up, oh, guys. We, we've come. We've come so far. We really have. But let's go. Let's go chill by the pool. Guys, so we are at Palm Beach. The sun is out. It's really nice and warm. Look at the arc. This is the infamous arc of the Atlantis and we're literally just about to sit here, chill, take a few pics. Guys, you see me sweating when I'm doing nothing? Yeah. The weather is banging, absolutely banging. I love the fact that this is literally all. I literally can't believe this is this is man-made. The beach. It's got real sand, but it's man-made. Anyway, I'm about to lie here and try and get a shot with me lying down with the arc deliverables and that. There's all these sun loungers. And oh, I like this one. This is a bit of me. This is a bit of me indeed. I want to go and check out the water. It's actually sandy. Very nice. Let's go check out the water. I bet it's going to be nice and warm as well. Wow. Oh, that is lovely. Babe, it's really warm. Habibi, come to Dubai. Habibi, can you drag this thing down so that we can put this there? Hopefully, you don't phone me. I don't care for no phone. There's three of them. One, two, three. They're like translucent. Cool. Do you reckon that's what bit you? 
Oh, so many of them. Yeah. One, two, yeah, no. three, four. Oh, there's so many of them. Yeah, there's tons of them. One, two, three. But I don't think that's what bit me. A fish bite wouldn't hurt. What I've got is a sting. It's definitely a sting. In fact, I think my skin's starting to react. Guys, as we're in the water, Damini's like, oh my god, something just stung me. And I'm like, what are we talking about? The same thing stung me too. So we came and we asked the lifeguard, and the lifeguard said they have jellyfish. Look, I don't know if you can see in the camera, maybe not. I'll probably give you a zoom in. But I have the same, same marks that Damini has, but it's just a little bit itchy. What should we do about it? Oh, let me see. Do it for me here, please. Yeah. Yeah. Does that help? Yeah, it's very sweet. I put vinegar. You put vinegar? Ah! Yeah. Liquid spray. I'm just getting sprayed by vinegar. Thank you. I like the smell of it. You need ma'am paramedic, I call paramedic. No, it's paramedic. Okay. Oh girl, girl, we're good. Thank you, it's okay, fine. Okay, okay. <laughs> paramedic. Can you imagine getting a paramedic for jelly sting? I cracked my ribs. <laughs> I don't know why we're laughing. <laughs> I did. We were meant to be going to the water park and the water park looks so much fun. I can't lie, it looks like the most amount of fun. But your girl knows herself. I literally just said. I'm still gonna go. You're gonna go? With the GoPro, yeah. Interesting. It's okay. the biggest water park in the world. Like, I don't want to miss out. On that that just sounds like the biggest injury I can sustain. That's literally what I'm hearing. Yeah, Damini says he still wants to go to the water park. But I literally sat and thought about it earlier on and I was like, as much as I'd love to, I'd rather not. I'd rather just leave Dubai like happy, healthy, safe and tanned, you know? And now with a jellyfish sting. Well, it's okay. Like, it's only a little sting. It's not too bad. And now I'm going to smell like vinegar for a cocktail hour. But it's okay. I'm going to go upstairs, go and get changed and dry my hair a little bit. Yeah, pretty nice and chill day as well today. I'm enjoying myself really have looking forward to cocktail hour getting changed getting dressed and looking cute that's literally what holidays are about but yeah let's go guys the whole of today every so often you just hear us screaming Habibi, come to Dubai. literally that's just what it is which one that one oh this one definitely i'm always worried about your ears babe. but i think that one goes way better this one okay heavy b oh these are black owned by the way these are from a black owned business called epiphany jewels or epiphany jewelry. I'm gonna have it linked below. Face beat. I did my face beat in like 35, 40 minutes. That's good. That's good for me. I'll show you my fit in a minute because this light is not doing it. Also, I need to do my lips. But right now we are off to cocktail hour. Well, it's actually a cocktail two hours, but we have one hour left of cocktails. I'm very, very impressed with myself for being able to get ready in time. So am I. Thanks, babe. Well done. Thank you. I actually really like these ones. I think I prefer them. I always ask Dabi for his opinion and then I'm like, okay, well, I want to do the other one. Yeah. I might wear these later on because we have dinner after this and I'm going to come back and get changed just so that I can get some different picks. Yeah, I think these are better. I'll change to these later on so that, you know, everybody's happy. I'm happy. He's happy. The earrings are happy. Calling your phone because I'm lonely. Hopefully you gon' phone me. Okay, let me give you a quick outfit of the night. I am really proud of how this all came together because I've got this top, this is from Mercy, that same brand from yesterday. Excuse my very loud bangles. But speaking of, my bangles are black owned Epiphany Jewels. Same as my earrings, actually. Oh my God. Yes, yeah, so I got them at the same time. I bought these at the same time. This green top is from Mercy. I really like this. It's like a halter neck, low back, really nice low back halter neck. And then the skirt. I have been wanting this skirt for so long on PLT, but it stays forever sold out. And it actually has a really nice green matching top. The green top didn't work for me. Like when I got it, it didn't work for me. So, so I really love the way the two match together. It looks kind of like a one piece. My favorite heels, chunky wedges this summer. I have completely finished this shoe. Cost per wear has got to be down to a peanut because I wear them all the time. Like they're my favorite holiday shoe. So this is where we're going, Imperial Club. And we're gonna go for drinks in here. wings they've got empanadas they've got samosas this is definitely a bit of us some popcorn some doritos guacamole bread love bread and olives i love calcutta olives Yes, only shine. 
look at the ceiling. Everything here is just made to look like you are a fish. <laughs> Something to do with fish, look. The ground is like marble, but it looks like fish scales. I love it. it, looks so good. And the ceiling as well, it looks like a little fish flying or floating. This place, we're leaving quite late. We were literally drinking, having a good time, chatting. Got some popcorn to go as we head back to our room and then wait for dinner. Oh, but they've got coffee here, look. We had some of this, this is like traditional coffee. It's got saffron and it's got kind of cardigan, 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 whichever one. Sure. We've come into a shop and look what I saw. <gasps> Guys, a crunchy hot Cheetos, flaming hot Dubai edition. Absolutely, a big fat yes for me. We've also got some apple juice, which is for our mixer, which we're gonna have when we get home. We're gonna get litty. So this is like an incense that you can burn. It smells so good. I'm actually tempted. I'm tempted. Feeling a little bit lit. What's it called? Cocktail hour? Champagne cocktails. Champagne cocktails. I need to um, regather myself. We have dinner at what time? 7, 8, 9. 9 30. And right now it's probably about 8 30. I can't have some watch because I'm probably too much stuff. They organize our shoes. They're so cute. We had um, turn down service when we went here. So they closed down the curtains and they spread our beds and they gave us new flowers. Look at these. These are cute. This is cute. We still have two beds, guys. To be honest, it was actually really handy last night because I had night sweats. So we jumped from this bed and we went into this bed. And it was great. I love it when they do this. Look, <laughs> they folded the bonnet. This is so cute. When was the last time you saw your, bon your bonnet folded? New water and they've just tidied up in general. It's very nice. I wish I had a turn down service in our house, like truly and really. And then in the bathroom, they hung up Dummy's shorts, which was really cute. And they organized, look, I love it when they do this. They're like, your makeup can go with your mirror, with your toothpaste, with your beauty blender. And then here you can have your antiseptic and you can have your eyes and you can have your toothbrush. And they kept the roses. Put the flowers on the side, it was in the bath. Wow, aye aye aye, anyway. We're gonna get lit. This is where we're having dinner. It's a Lebanese spot and I'm very excited about this. I love me a Lebanese grill. Look at this, wow. Oh, it smells lovely in here. She moved out of state, shit that went left, she's seeking forgiveness. She used to dance, but she went alone and start up a business. Her daddy was not around, her mama was not around. I watch her climb to the top of the pole and then get sliding down. I make it rain in this bitch. I make it snow in this bitch. She trying to get out of the beach. We have a whole feast. Oh, it's so big. It's like a tapasa. I love the passion that they have for food here. They're like the king of bread. <laughs> Mm. These are just the starters. That's bang. Tell you, really bang. It's got a smoky flavour. Guys, they gave us way too much food. But this, the salad has to be the best. It's got like croutons, it's got lettuce, it's got cucumbers. Mm. It's too much. I'm eating so good at Atlantis, it's ridiculous. I'm gonna leave here at least 5 kgs of it. Shotty was going to jail. Me, I'm supporting this shit. This is a story that came from my life, and I'm just supporting this shit. I'ma just give it to you, do it instead of me throwing this shit. So in the Arabic Bistro also, we have obviously two lamb chops. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, we have a lamb kofta or lamb kebab. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. As well as the chicken kebab chicken, or chicken kofta. Yeah. And over there we have the lamb brochette or lamb tenderloin. And arais. So arais is a stuffed bread with minced meat. I think some bread is. Yeah. yeah, and it's very good. We have baked potato as well. And the bread over here is a bit spicy. Okay, there's like a chili relish on top. Nice, thank, thank you. you. I already feel defeated, thank you. The Wonderful, food is too much. too much. They have overfed us at the Atlantis farm. Oh my god. These guys don't know how to say or how to accept a no because we said no to dessert. We have Moroccan tea. We said no to dessert. No, like, oh no, 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 no. You cannot leave without some uh, digestive yeah. tea. Look I at this. Pastry roll. <laughs> we said no. <laughs> Thank you. And then ice cream as well. It's baklava ice cream. You guys don't know how to say no. <laughs> they don't. We never say no. You never say no. <laughs> you say yes, 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 yes. Thank you. Oh my gosh. 
May I serve it for you, please? Uh, please, please, you have to. <laughs> <laughs> really? There's more. Yeah, a very There's good so way. much food in all the directions. Thank you. It's a good night's sleep. I will sleep very well. I'm gonna have to wake up tomorrow. Thank you very Thank much. You. Look at that. It smells really good though. And then like that the with the tea and the passion fruit. And everything. And the ice cream. I'm tired even thinking about it. And the prosecco. Praise God. What a night. What, what a, a night. night. Baby, cheers. May I just serve you? Thank you. Mix it with the, with the baklava ice cream and it will be fantastic flavor. No more. <laughs> I promise. Now I'll say, that I'll now. say yes. And then as, yeah. as we're drinking our tea, yes, can you some more, more food will come. <laughs> no, <I'm asking. laughs> Yes means Thank no, no much. means yes. Please enjoy it. Thank you. Thank you. you a little poso baby. You a little 48 baby. Got a little candy in a pocket. When she gon' take off like a... Good morning guys, good morning. We have literally run down to the hot air balloon. The Dubai balloon at Atlantis. You see that behind us? Guys, it is... Hot. It is so hot. Like it's so 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 hot. I'm like sweating. Let me turn this way so you can see. But we wanted to go up the balloon and go for a little ride. But the thing is, so when we came here, the guy was like, "Your ticket is valid for the whole day." And I just think this might be better at sunset, like with a nice little sunset at the back. Where does the sunset? This way. So if I'm up there, can I take a picture with the sunset? Yeah. Perfect. So thank you. So yeah, we're gonna come back at sunset, guys. Look at the way I'm sweating just standing here. Wait, let's get some aqua tickets. Thank you. You wanna get the aqua tickets now? Yeah, let's just get them. So we're gonna get some aqua. Tickets. When we came here, guys, we came on these little buggies, like one of these. We're probably gonna get one, jump on those, to head back to the hotel because it is so hot. This is a little taxi. Hello. Yes. Yes, please. Yes, we first collect the bed. Sure. Then I proceed to the water park. Then I will drop you in the hotel. Okay, thank I explore you. Explore you all of the places. Thank okay. you. You you will enjoy the tour. <laughs> I'm thank sure we will. Guys, we are back. Quickly got changed. We are going to the world's largest aqua park. They have so many rides, so I came back and changed into a bikini. And this bikini should be able to hold me properly. Black owned swim from Misa Swim. I've just reset my edges because it is so hot outside, it literally melted away. Which they're gonna do the exact same thing again in three minutes, but at least I'll get a picture. Let me show you my fit. We have got, like I said, a black owned swim brand called Misa Swim on the bikini. I've had this for a few years. I, last time I wore this was in Tenerife, and I like this bikini because it holds everything in place as opposed to my string bikinis where things will be flying off left and right and there's kids i don't want to end up in jail and then the cover-up is from plt cute little cover-up from plt bangles black owned again epiphany jewels i'm a drink of choice for the holiday has been dead man fingers i don't like the name of it by the way yeah no, it's a wild name it's like a british rum who knows what that means it's made in bristol bristol yeah it says, inspired by our spiced rum from St. Ives, Cornwall. Guys, Damini's worried about his hair because his hair's just been neatly locked, like recently locked. Look at how fresh and how gorgeous it looks. Shout out to and Kim, then, Magical Fingers. Shout out to Kim, Magical Fingers. And then now we're about to go into a water park and literally... So now I'm Bryson tittering it with a hat. Don't! 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 Yeah, 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 yeah! She's gonna scream. Hey guys, very much looking forward to this shark attack team. Come on. Come 
to the Atlantis balloon. By the way, it is what time is it? It's like 5 5 30. We were hoping to get like a nice sunset, like a nice sunset ride up in the balloon. However, it's windy. The wind is now stopping it from going up, which is a bit annoying. As you can see, it's grounded. The operation of the hot air balloon is completely dependent on the weather. And they actually warned us of this earlier on, but we just thought, oh, probably gonna be fine. It looks like it might not be so. I really want a nice sunset shot. I've got this gorgeous pink two-piece on that I think would look really, really great with a sunset in the background. So we might just end up back at Nobu because Nobu have a rooftop and try and take a picture there and then come back and go for a hot air balloon ride, which won't be over sunset, but still be cute. I think we'll still take a picture with this scene. This the lady who worked here went to go and check how long it might be for us to go and fly. So we're back in the hotel room because we wanted to take some pictures. I really wanted my sunset picture and the hot air balloon is definitely closed until tomorrow. Well, it's not closed, but next time it's gonna go up within the next hour and the sunset's gonna be gone. I need a sunset shot, so we're gonna do it tomorrow morning, first thing in the morning. Sunrise. Sunrise. I don't know how I'm gonna do Who's doing makeup at sunrise? I wish you could just peel makeup off, like one big mask, like put it on as a mask, take it off as a mask. That's literally what I wanna do. But for now, we're gonna go and enjoy happy hour. Look at Damani. We're matching. We are. Praise God. Colourful. And the housekeeper just came and took some fire pictures of us. Room service. He came to clean up. But we're about to go to happy hour. I'm planning on drinking at least six glasses of champagne. At least. Guys, the time is 7.47. We have been in the lounge. The exec lounge. We've been drinking, guys. Drinking. 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 <laughs> drinking and the last one. Taken of our glasses, by the drinking. Way. It has been cocktail hour, wow. and we ma maximized it. I can't even speak straight. Habibi, Yalla. come to Dubai. Habibi, <laughs> we're about to go for dinner now, and dinner is at En Fuego. I absolutely love my outfit. My outfit is full PLT, PLT top. I love this little bit here, and then the trousers are like palazzo white trousers. I love me a palazzo white trousers. sunrise right there we've come just at the perfect time the balloon has already gone up for its first ride it seems as though we might just be lucky as the sun rises in the background i'm so excited morning guys morning it is 6 29 a.m we are about to get on the balloon look at it coming down sunrise is looking so good let me show you sunrise as the balloon comes down all the way at the top. This is the, the furthest that the balloon goes. You can see people kayaking at the bottom. You get a really nice, great view. Look at all of that. Someone on the boat. It's very nice. Yeah, it's great. You can see the hotel here. It's a really great shot of the hotel. It's a really, really great view. Like, it feels like being a bird. <laughs> it feels like I'm a bird in the sky. You can just like walk around. There's not that many people here. Sunrise. Big water. <laughs> so cute. What do you think, babe? It's very nice. It's nice, babe.
so this is saffron and guys when i saw mimi last week mimi was like lydia you have to make sure you eat at saffron she was proper guessing it so ah, 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 here we go so excited <laughs> Donuts, almond croissants, chocolate croissants, cheese croissants, pistachio danishes, brioche. Guys, there's even a, a chocolate fountain. There's sweets. I love the fish in the sky. This is very, very nice. This whole place is actually ridiculous. I have had pretty much food from every single station. I haven't even explored the other half though. This is what my plate looks like and I'm very pleased. Look at my feast, my haul of food. Oh, then I also of course grabbed two parapas, which are basically chapatis. Atlantis is amazing. We are now off to see our friends. I'm gonna go and see our friends and stay with them for a few days and I'm so excited. Winnie and Andrew, you guys have met them when we went to their wedding in South Africa. Thank you for us. Oh, thank you for having us. We'll see you soon. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How about you? I'm um, great, thank you. Bye Atlantis guys. These guys have the best staff members. Everybody's so kind. I'm very well, thank you. Thank you, thank you. The mirror, I'm doing my dance. Ain't packing out nobody's pants. He a rapper, but don't got a chance. Stuck in my way, so I'm loving my bands. Like a million views in a day. It's so many ways to get paid. I tried dipping, he begged me to stay. Bay, I'm not staying, I just wanna play. In the party, he just wanna run. Big boobs in the bus, they pump. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. She a baddie with her baddie friend. They like ice, how you always stay hot. Oh, they mad cause I keep making bops. Oh, she mad cause I'm taking her spot. If I was bitches, I'd hate me a lot. Like, damn, she and her mood. What's up guys? What's up? Happy Saturday. We have been at Winnie and Andrew's for the last three days and guys I have barely vlogged. Literally I have barely vlogged. The last time you saw us properly was when we were checking out of the Atlantis but the last few days, the last three days has just been rest, restoration, relaxation, all of the R's like all of the R's that I so, so desperately needed. I I picked up this camera. I've got a few clips here and there. Maybe let me try and walk you through what we did. So we first got here on Thursday afternoon. Thursday afternoon, checked into their lovely home, which literally, Dami and I walked in. The first thing we were like, we need to do better. I know that right now we're working on our own home transformation, but we actually need to step up our game because their home is so inviting. It's so warm. It's so comforting. I haven't left. Everyone's trying to get me to leave the house. And I'm like, no. <laughs> <laughs> no sir, I'm comfy, I'm relaxing, I'm having a good time. Like literally, do you guys ever get that? Do you get like when sometimes you just don't want to do anything? Like I know I'm in a different country and I know I should probably be out there exploring. But we can always come back to Dubai. Like we can literally always come back to Dubai. We literally have friends who live here so we can come back any other time and I can do all the other stuff if I want to. But right now your girl is tired. Like I'm a tired babe. I'm a tired babe ramen making, chilling on the sofa era and I'm so happy for me so happy so we got here on thursday afternoon checked in literally feels like a hotel god damn literally checked in to this beautiful home i love it here how am i gonna leave how am i leaving here tomorrow so the first thing that we did together was we went to dinner at hutong and it was so delicious they have like these things called brunches here in dubai it was a brunch but it was at 9 30 p.m <laughs> so we went to brunch and it was like unlimited prosecco unlimited cocktails some delicious asian food it was just like the starters unlimited guys the starters is really where it's at andrew was telling us that you know you need to make sure you load up load up well on the starters because mwah, you know the mains were i they were i literally like he said they were just i but the starters were incredible so after that after hutong we literally just came back and just caught up and just literally had a good old chin work, like literally talking about everything i love meeting up with other couples winnie and andrew newly married as well we went to their wedding you guys saw their wedding in south africa i'm gonna link the video here if you guys haven't watched it but that was such a ball so we just kind of 
caught up properly since the wedding and like oh it's just so nice a couple that you can really have just a really good chat about life relationships good bads all that stuff like it was really really like really edifying actually really edifying they're very goal orientated they're very much into their wellness holistic practices being a better version of you they're very much on par with what Danny and I are about. So it was really nice catching up with them that evening. And then on Friday, we had a very, very lazy start to the day. We literally slept most of the day. We woke up at like 1 p.m. and just chilled indoors, guys. Like Danny and I, sometimes we need to learn the art of doing nothing. The art of doing nothing is literally an art because we are always doing A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and sometimes just chill. So we had a really restful Saturday, caught up again with Winnie and Andrew, just chatting literally the whole morning. And it was just so edifying. I feel so rich being here, like rich in spirit, rich in growth. And it's literally been three days. And then yesterday evening we went to Time Out. Time Out is like a magazine that we have in London as well, but obviously they have it here too. And it's essentially like just a food hall. There was just loads of different cuisines. And we also got to see like the light and water show right next to the Burj. And it was just so cool, so cute, very nice relaxing day. And then now today is Saturday. Winnie, Andrew and Damini went to like this basically like the ACS. <laughs> it's like a group of where all the people that, like all the black people in Dubai have just got this big group chat where they're all together and they all meet up every so often to do stuff together. And today they're having a sports day. Damini is there, Damini loves people. Damini is such a people person and he actually gains energy from being with people. I am the complete opposite. Today drained me. I can, I'm literally the perfect ambivert. I am great with people. I like, I like people, I love people also. But people tire me out, girl. They do, after a while, I'm like, <laughs> Where's my robe? I'm trying to be inside. Literally, Winnie and Andrew were like concerned about me this morning. They were like, okay, day one, didn't want to go out, we get it. Day two, didn't want to go out, we get it. But day three, you don't want to go out? Are you okay? I'm like, if you guys leave me by myself, I'm gonna be better than ever. Like literally, I'm in the middle of making ramen right now, boiling my egg, about to sit down on the sofa and catch up on Netflix, probably go on TikTok, probably catch up, hell. I might even take a nap. Like, to me, that's perfect, you know? Your girl feels good, your girl feels great. I'm feeling so blessed, I'm feeling so thankful for Winnie and Andrew because this has just been literally what I needed. This has been the perfect oasis, like the perfect getaway from all the busyness. Especially considering how busy we were the first three days at the Antis. You've got to use the show, okay? Let me go show you my little ramen or whatever. Mm? This is my little ramen station. I'm boiling my egg in the ramen water, leftover. I've got my beef right here. I've got the soup, I've got the sauce. I've already got the ramen. I just need to mix everything up. Even, look, even some seaweed. So guys, I'm feeling so freaking lucky and so blessed. This is perfect. I've literally got Damini here saying he was trying to get me out. And I was like, no, I'm literally having a good time. Hope you're relaxing. Um, it was worth a try. I told him this was my vibe. <laughs> my vibe is very much ramen. And yeah, he says, glad that you're resting and enjoying yourself. This is what they're all up to. <laughs> Shout out to my man for the video. Guys, he's literally vlogging for you guys because I, I ain't doing that. Well, this is what I'm doing. Whilst he's vlogging, this is what your girl is doing. So shout out to Damini for always looking out for your girl and looking out for all of you guys too. Mm, let me go make my ramen. Let me finish my ramen. I love those TikToks when people are like, how long do you boil an egg for? Until you forget about it. Until you forget. You're like, oh, I was boiling an egg. That's exactly how long you boil the egg for. This is delicious. Oh. Mm -mm. Let me enjoy my egg. Guys, we'll catch up a little later on, okay? In the party, he just went around. This is how my ramen is looking. I'm just about to add this sauce. Oh my gosh, guys. I literally cannot wait. This is everything. This is all I ever wanted in life. Are you crazy? Guys, recipe linked in the description box for this because what? I present to you ramen. What's up, guys? Checking in. It's 7 p.m. And I'm gonna go out. I'm gonna go out after my ramen, after chilling, that she spent the whole day doing nothing. And I hear that the party is turning up. I said, let me go. So I'm gonna go out. I've just packed all our suitcase so that tomorrow we're leaving first thing in the morning. We're packed, we're ready. So now I can go and get lit. I have a good time. Last night out in Dubai. Wow, what a turn of events. Ambivert, I said, right? I'm in and I'm out. I'm inside and I'm outside. I did inside today. Now I'm about to go do outside. About to order my Kareem, which is like the Uber. Um, I'm wearing my Kai Collective bikini underneath, black owned, and I'm wearing the Mercy dress, but I'm wearing it as a off shoulder number today. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Guys, we are pulling up to the beach. I'm kind of nervous. 
Seoul Beach, Dubai. Walking down through here. There's yachts, of course. <laughs> what else do you expect from Dubai? Habibi, come to Dubai. 